Hello everyone and welcome back to another Schlib on Switch unboxing video. Today we've got a package from NIS America. And inside we have bubble wrap. Underneath the bubble wrap we have Disgaea 6, Defiance of Destiny for a hybrid device. And also in the box we have this little extra stuff. And then a uh, packing slip. Alright, that's it for the box. All right, so yeah, so we have the Disgaea 6 Collector Edition from NAS America and stuff packed outside, which I am not happy about because I do not like when that happens. All right, so let's check all this awesome stuff out. I really like the Disgaea franchise. Uh, <laughs> I haven't played as much as I'd like to have, but yeah, I really like it. All right, so here we have the... Uh, Stitched together pin sets of three of the characters. And then we got the back of the packet over there. Over here is what I'm going to assume is the cloth poster. I'm just going to be let's, uh, check this one out. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Stand up and do this one. Ooh, this one's tall. All right. Let's uh, move my camera a bit over here. This is one tall poster. You can see a lot of different characters on it. Yeah, that is the clock poster that comes with this. That's going to be fun to fold back together. And I'm probably going to give up before I even begin. All right, let's deal with that one later. All right, so we got the poster, we got the pin set, and now we have the actual collector edition box. It's uh, nice and small, uh, about average size for NAS games. It looks like it runs a little different. This limited edition box contains a bunch of stuff. A uh, box contains stuff that's not in the box, so yay. Always love when that happens. All right, let's open this up. All right. I really like the uh, art on the front of the box. You got that? All right. So let's see how this opens up. And so it opens up like that, and I kind of like that compared to uh, most Nisa collector editions. And we got the uh, character sprite work on the side of the box. And it looks like this is supposed to be pop-up, but didn't really work out too well. All right, so here we have you know a nice background over there, and some character pop art over here, the little base over there. All right. So first things, and here we have is the game itself. We'll uh, look at that one last. Under that, we have the Disgaea 6 Steelbook. I loved this when I first saw it. thought this was one of the coolest Steelbooks, but uh, other cool Steelbooks have launched since. I'm going to let you guess which ones I'm referring to, or which one. And we got the title on the spine, which is nice, and we got the logo over there. So, really, really nice Steelbook. Like, really nice. Definitely one of the top tier, not the best though. And some really nice uh, artwork inside. I like that Nisa is getting more into the Steelbook game. All right, under there we have, oh, as you take more stuff out, we see more art of this thing over there. All right, let's flip this over. Let gravity get the stuff out for us. All right. So here we got the soundtrack, which uh, we'll get this one open. All right, so here we have the soundtrack disc with the uh, same little artwork on the front. We got the spine, we got the track list on the back, which shows us we got two discs. So we open up inside and we got a little uh, text over there, which you can pause and read that. There, just flat piece of paper, yep, flat piece of paper. And we got the first disc. Which is a nice art on it. I like it. And then we got the second disc. And with some nice art again. And then the back. Alright, that is the art book. 
Uh, it's, well, I don't know what I'm saying. That is the soundtrack. Really nice. All right, next up. Now, this is the art book. Um, again, with the usual... Wow, that is hard to get out. There we go. Usual Nisa style. We got this really nice hardcover art book. Kind of feels kind of sticky, which is weird. Um, it's like the fake leather is sticky. Behind this seams art book. It's got the Sky Six finds a destiny, and we got the table of contents, and we got um, the Japanese standard standard edition package illustration. And we'll just flip through this quickly. It looks like a really nice art book to go through. All right. And uh, yeah, so that is everything. Oh, no, you didn't actually go look at the game yet. Never mind that. All right, here is the full artwork of this little pop up art. It's kind of neat. Would be cool if it actually worked. I really like this design of the box, though. Makes it easier to go through everything. And uh, doesn't damage when you open and close it. All right, so now we have the actual game, which we almost missed. Done that before. <laughs> All right. So we got the uh, front of the case. Really nice artwork over there. We've got the spine. And we got the back. And it contains a mini art book and a soundtrack digital download and includes four bonus characters. And there is the barcode over there. And it has in-game purchases, which is always nice. I'm joking. Unless it's good. Alright, I'll bring this one off camera. Don't want to show off any DLC codes like I've done in the past. Alright, so here we got a reversible artwork, which is really nice. And we got the cartridge. With the code on the front. And the code on the back. And if we pop it into our switch, we've got the icon over there. We got version 1.0.0 on cart. And there is an update available. And if we go and redeem it for gold points, just checking, we get. No points. Um, that's interesting because usually Nisa is good with that. Uh, maybe tomorrow will work. And we got this little warranty card. And we got this little packaging here. So let's rip this one open. And the first thing we have is our soundtrack digital download with the track list and the other side has the code and some more text there and if you want you can redeem the code for three downloads at that URL then we got a little advertisement for some exclusive Disgaea merch which is nice and they do reward points which rack up when you buy a lot of stuff in them We'll be good for all those uh, Kaseki stuff coming up in 2022 and 2023. Definitely ready to spend a shit ton of money on all that. And then we got the uh, little mini art book, which is a bit redundant with the big one, but it's really nice. Um, so everything that came in this box will be uh, available if you just buy the standard game retail. Um, the Unrelenting Edition, as they call it. All right, so that is the Disgaea 6 collector edition let me know did you pick this up did you pick up the standard edition do you, what are your thoughts on the sky and all right thank you so much for watching this video as always if you like this video like comment subscribe share etc have a great day thank you for watching bye